All right, we are back at our base again. We got our went ahead and took the liberty of getting our food and water under control, and I slept for I believe eight hours. Got a save dropped. Now we're gonna head back down to the Brotherhood and do a quest for them. I'm debating on whether to take my power armor with me or not. Let me check it. Before I jump in, let's see how many fusion cores I actually have with me. Ooh. Don't think I have any more than just that one. Uh, oh. Never mind. I got 11 of them. Yeah, let's try to burn some of those up. Let's grab a couple of those to take with us. Even though it's just T45s, it'll give us a lot of protection. So we're heading out. So we are going to go down and meet up with the Brotherhood and actually do at least one of the quests with the two Brotherhood people. And then we're going to head on to Diamond City where I can park this thing down in... Um Ooh, I don't know if I have enough money. By I might not have enough money to buy the the player base down there. Might be best just to leave this in there. Oh well, we'll take it with us for now. And I'm stuck. Alright. Well, we came across the Red Stag Doe. Give us some little meat there on our way here. It's the only thing we've found so far since we've had it out on this. Oh. And the Mr. Gutsy. Gut. Gutsy. I don't know. Don't really know where that guy went. Oh well. We'll, we'll continue heading on to Cambridge. We'll go ahead and do this, knock this out before we go exploring around here and other places. I really want to do one of their missions and then head into Diamond City so that way I can actually sell stuff. I want to get Hangman's Alley down there beside it and I also want to get the place in, uh, inside Diamond City as the player base. That way we have some nice little areas we can come back to while we're exploring Boston area. Dance. Glad to see you alive and well, sir. Are we in luck, sir? Mission accomplished. We have the transmitter. Finally, some good news for a change. Nice work, sir. I didn't do it alone. Aelin, Reese, it's time to welcome our newest recruit to the recon team. She shows a lot of promise, and with the proper guidance, I think she has the potential of becoming one of the best. Recon, huh? So, what are we looking for? Don't worry about it. Talk to Reese and I after we're done here, and we'll explain everything. So you decided to stay, huh? I expected you to take your payment and run. Let's just hug this out and get it over with, huh? What do you say? You can play it however you want, tough girl. It's gonna take a lot more than completing one mission to impress me. Reese, that's enough. Like it or not, you're going to have to learn to work together. And you... You need to understand what it means to be a part of the Brotherhood. We're not soldiers of fortune. We're an army. And we've dedicated our lives to uphold a strict code of ethics. If you intend to stay within our ranks, you need to obey our tenets without question. Are you going to teach me this code of ethics? If you were paying attention in Arcjet, you should have learned some of it already. The rest will become apparent as you spend time with your fellow soldiers. Now. Since I know you're eager to get started, I'll get right to the point. I only ask for two things from anyone under my command. Honesty and respect. You fall in line, you stay in line. I give you an order, and you follow it. It's as simple as that. Now, before I release you to Halen and Reese for your assignments, there's one last order of business. From this moment forward, I'm granting you the rank of Initiate. This is only a training rank. 
I'm not permitted to grant ranks any higher than that. Fair enough. Outstanding, soldier. Ad Victorium, Initiate. She doesn't even know what that means, Halen. Ad Victorium means to victory. In our eyes, defeat is unacceptable. Because we're fighting for the future of mankind. Our rallying cry is more powerful than any weapon you could ever carry. Remember that. Now, I need you to report to Halen or Reese for your next assignment. Dismissed, soldier. All right, let's go Excuse ahead and Excuse me, get, scribe Halen. Go ahead and get the Are quest. still giving you the cold shoulder. Why does he hate me? He doesn't hate you. Reese bleeds brotherhood. It's all he cares about. It's his family. It's his whole life. If anything else comes into the picture and gets in the way, he shoves it aside. Is there something between the two of you? That's none of your business. Look, just give Reese some time. I'm sure he'll see you're a valuable member of the team, and he'll come around. So, are you ready to take on your first assignment? Ready. Great. Let me explain what I need you to do. One of the Brotherhood's most important duties is the recovery and preservation of technology that was lost when the bombs fell. I have a list of locations that contain artifacts we need you to recover in order to have them cataloged and studied by our scribes. Here, this should cover all the information you'll need to find your first artifact. Good luck, and be careful. All right, we got her first quest. Excuse me. All right. Grab I'll his quest. You. What's your game? And these are uh, quests you can do over and over. What do you mean? I can usually size people up at a glance, but you, you're different, and it's bugging the heck out of me. You're not the military type. You're a loner, so I can't figure out why you're sticking around. You got what you wanted, so why don't you hit the road? The Brotherhood might be the best chance I'll ever have to find my son. Well, as far as reasons go, that's a pretty good one. Look, I'm gonna cut you some slack because Dance trusts you. But if you step out of line and put any of my brothers or sisters in danger, I'll make sure you regret it. So, ready for your assignment, hero? Ready. Then listen up. Like it or not, one of our most important duties is to keep the Commonwealth clear of the trash. I'm talking about mutants, ghouls, synths. The abominations the damn eggheads caused when they started playing with their toys. This op is simple. I'm gonna send you to a target, and you're gonna terminate everything that calls it home. All the details you need are right here. Don't come back until the job's done. It can be so hard to find right. facts these days. One's us got both of those set up. Man, oh man. That was a hell of a fight, wasn't it? Watching those barrels get blown apart was the best thing I've seen. Has anyone Let's ever told you that you're a Drop our power armor off. Oh, 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 oh. Let's take the fusion cores so that way they don't run off with it. I'm going to be lugging around three fusion cores. Drop save. All right, we're good to go. I don't think Dance is going to give us Paladin. anything You're a else. Brotherhood initiate now. Feel free to take whatever supplies you need for your assignments. Yeah, I don't think he's going to give us anything else. So we are going to leave our power armor here. That way we can come back to it. And what did he? What quest did he give us? Clear out College Square. All right. Support the recon team. We're going to do that. We're going to do that by clearing out the college square. All right. Let's go ahead and rock out. And it should be an easy one to get our feet wet with the Brotherhood. It's pretty close. We can go ahead and knock it out. Yeah, college square. Shouldn't have too much opposition between here and there. Might see some Faragals. All right, bars are st we're still hidden. We're actually not doing too awful bad so far. You just head over here without attracting too much attention. Head down here to the subway station. Up oh, there we go. 
And I'm stuck. Alright, there we go. And into the College Square Station. Alright, there we go. So, let me check something out. Did I? What we Right now, we brought with us 10 millimeter pistol. We got the sniper rifle and righteous authority. Got some throwables, frag grenades, Molotov cocktails, and a couple odd frag mines. Just garbage. Pipe revival revolver. Got some little bit of food in there. Let's see. Ooh, some extra nuclear cola. Those are always good for when you get tired. Oh. Disarm the trap. Speaking of that, I wonder if I can take that two levels up to spend. I can't take that till 21 and that till 18, so it's kind of a waste. And I'm going to go ahead and drop that. <clears throat> I'm going to go ahead and drop the points into sneak. 20% harder to sneak. Oh, no. Oh, yep. Can't have the agility for that. So, three agility. Oh, boy. Alright, go ahead and drop a point into agility and take sneak one. Yeah, 20% harder to sneak. Plus, the agility will give us more action points. That'll come in handy. That a bunch of crap. Nothing too too spectacular there. Pull out my scoped hunting rifle. If I could get him. Alright, there's one. Two down. One shot, one gale. That's pretty cool. There's a Protectron back there. If I could get back to him, he could probably clear this place out for me. Oh. <laughs> kind of snuck up on us there. What? Dog meat is going crazy. And my bars are going nuts here. Somebody's close. Let's see. Sneak in here and see what we got. Suit box suitcase. Let's see what we got in here. Got it. Just some random loot, but some fashionable glasses. Gives us a plus one to our charisma. I don't think I'm wearing any any glasses right now. Oh no, I am wearing I'm wearing sunglasses. Plus one to perception. That gives me plus one to charisma. We could save that for later if you're I'm going to switch back and forth whenever you sell items, get a better barter price. Me, I know, I know I could switch, like, I could put the dress on and then the, the glasses and the hat, boost charisma. And it does make a big difference on uh, your overall caps, especially if you do it every single time. But there is so much loot that I take back and forth that I usually don't worry about it too much. This one here had... Shot of medics in her leg. Yeah, just a bunch of random stuff. 10 millimeter auto pistol on the ground. Yeah, we'll go ahead and probably end up dropping most of this stuff later. Oh, there was a teddy bear. Oh, no, nothing special. A lot of times they'll have the teddy bears setting up. I love the, the different ways they have them set up. Alright, uh, there's a dead feral ghoul I killed earlier. We got a... Oh! A legendary feral ghoul. Let's see if we can take out his leg real quick. Alright, we got his leg down and he mutated. That's, that'll help us out there. Hopefully I'll get a lucky and get a... Ah, uh, du mighty double-barreled shotgun. It's not too bad. 25% more damage. I don't use shotguns, but eh, maybe we'll start using it for a minute. Switch over to our mighty shotgun. Alright, let's put that up where I usually keep my pipe rifle. Ah, the freaking killer monkey. And I don't have any shotgun ammo. Haha! <laughs>
It's always a good habit, I believe, to kill the monkeys. I hate the clacker monkeys. They always seem to be set up with freaking bombs or something. Nothing good has ever came from a clacker monkey. Alright, let's grab the... Grab the cigarettes. There we go. Alright, let's grab some more minted drugs there. Get some pre-war money. Ooh, lots of pre-war money. That's one thing I never usually put up on the trade thing is pre-war money. I don't know why, but... I always think by the end of the game I have so much of it where I don't put it up there. Go ahead and check these, get some bottle caps, some more money. Uh, moldy food. Take that with us, maybe we'll sell it later. Alright, let's keep on cruising. I really want to get back there. Ooh, subway token, for more pre-war money. Now I think the Protectrons, if you do the subway one, if you have, uh... They check you for a subway token. If you have one, they don't get hostile. I believe that's what I was reading on it, because I was always wondering what the point of the subway tokens were. Alright, let's see if we can break in here and unlocking. Ooh. Maybe. Alright, whoa, that was easy. Sweet. Alright, that'll get us in here. Let's see if there's anything cool. Hell yeah. Live and Love. You collected a issue of Live and Love. Companions permanently inflict 5% more damage. Ooh, that's a nice one. That'll come in handy for us. Let's see. More stem packs. More purified waters. We could set up pretty nice here. Alright, let's see if we can get this Protectron out here. I'm in. Alright, we're in. So, let's see. Choose personality mode. I always do the law enforcer. And back out. Activate. Alright. Got the protect protect Tron coming with us. See we can go that way. Just, yeah, that way's down. This way. Yeah, both of them go down, I believe. Whoa. That's the gas. Now, if we bring people back up here, we could actually light that on fire if there's a bunch of them. Unidentified intruder detected. Beginning search. What in the world? Oh, wait. Yeah, there, I forgot. There's more Protectrons down here. There we go. You're going to take all my kills. Oh, yeah, that was nice. Both of the Protectrons activated and cleared out this whole area down here for me. We still have a couple... Markers on our on our map down there. Some bowling pins down there. All right, let's see if we can head over and see what else we're missing over here. There should be a back. There's a back room there. All right, so let's grab this nuka cola and we'll check out this last room over here. Whoa! What in the world are you shooting at? And order. Has prevailed. Let's see, nothing good over there. Dog meat, would you quit running off? Everybody keeps running off, and I can't kill. Muzzled heart pepper, chemistry jar. Yeah, just some random loot and junk back here. Got some wonder glue, hey, some medic. Over here. Nope, nope, not, here. not talk to dog meat. Got some more food. Got some nice little bottle cap mine. That might come in handy later. Hey. Alright, let's make sure I didn't tell him to stay away. Alright, so if we can get past the Protectron. We can get back get out of my way. Get back to this last room we was at. Alright, so let's go in here. Let's see. Got some used oil can, duct tape, flip lighter. Grab the duct tape. This will all go back with us to. I have. Yeah. Go back with us to the. Uh,
Ha! I'll go back to our base. Yeah. Oop. And let all that fuel that was on the ground on fire with that Molotov. The question is, I wonder if I could go in here without burning myself. Oh, no, there it goes. All right, so that says we uh, actually cleared out this uh, area. So now we can go back for our reward. Got the key for the station right there. Let's go ahead and search this area real quick. Make sure we're not leaving anything behind. Oh, stem packing a hairbrush on him. Oh, and I'm finally over capacity. If I don't hurry, I'm going to break my legs. We got a pocketed metal chest piece. That's actually got nice damage resistance of 14. Electrical of 7. Actually, with what I'm fighting right now, that would probably be better. The bolt action pipe rifle. That's not really going to help me out. I'm actually going to throw some stuff on dog meat real quick. Hey. Give him my junk, and then we'll run out of here and run back. All right, so I've gave, given him all that he can pretty much carry. Now all that we got to do is pretty much leave and go talk to the uh, the the Brotherhood again and turn in the quest. Just run out of here. Yep, everything. Yeah, I think I got everything from here. <clears throat> All right, now back out. Try to slow it down a little bit. Make sure nothing, we don't just die randomly on the way there. Oh, there's a dead body there. Pocketed left. Ooh. Now, is all my stuff pocketed? I cannot remember. Pocketed metal chest piece. Alright, put that on. Thought there was another pocketed something I grabbed. Oh, there it is. Yeah, the pocketed left arm. I can't... Uh, I could put both of those on and probably... Or at least the arm on and be able to carry more, but... Uh, I don't think it's worth it. Need to head down to the Diamond City so that way I can sell some of this stuff. Alright, so we'll go back in here and finish our quest up. Alright, so let's head around here. Well, look who's back. I take it that area's clear? Affirmative. Looks like I got my surprise for the day. Yeah, take the. Now report to Paladin Dance. He said he had a mission for you. When you're ready for another rock, you know where to find me. All right, so that completed our first hey. cleansing the Commonwealth. Only prepped for another mission, because I've got just the place. Now these are radiant quests, so you can set here and you can redo them over and I'm over, ready. and they'll Roger that. just give you more There's random locations to clear location. out. Complete the mission. Report back to me. So we'll go ahead and reactivate that. This is a good way to actually um, get some locations unlocked. It helps to uh, out pretty much. It helps you get a lot of experience real quick. We still have so much. Make sure. All to right. Learn about so the our saved work. We made in the past <clears throat> and how to prevent us from repeating them. So if we talk to. Paladin Dance. Welcome back. I've got another mission for you, if you're ready. Sorry, not yet. We have a lot of work to do. All right, so I am not going to activate that quest. That is the Lost Patrol quest. That's the one I want to stay away from right now. I want to have a. Uh, uh, what is it? I want to say, is it Tigram? It's 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 one of the guys on the the Pridwin that'll uh, locating the artifact can actually be just as dangerous as bringing it send back. you on the Lost Patrol, and you get a power entry. armor piece when you do it. But since we are going to head out to Diamond City, 